we want to check and see how things are going at the airport because it's expected to be a busy day. MSP Airport is expecting around 40,000 passengers to pass through TSA checkpoints, making today the busiest of the holiday week. Joining us this morning is Jeff Lee, manager of strategic communications for the airport. It's pretty early, but we have seen the crowds. How are things going out there so far this morning, Jeff? Good morning, Shayla. Well, I got here about six o'clock and we probably hit the peak, you know, 15 minutes ago with about uh, 20 minute waits at Terminal 2 and our South Checkpoint, 15 minutes here. And just in those 15 minutes, the TSA has been able to reduce those lines wow. to under 10 minutes here on the north. So that's great. It happens in waves. And so uh, I think you can expect today that uh, during certain times it will be 20 minutes, maybe 25 at the most. Um, but then other times you may see what you're seeing now, which is under 10 minutes, which is great news. Yeah, that is great news. So this leads to a great question, Jeff. Like, how do you handle staffing? when it comes to the anticipation of a big day. I mean, we know that we've been talking about this all week, but everyone's ready, but how do you handle staffing levels right now? Well, we have multiple partners. We have the TSA, we have our airlines, we have our staff that help us here at the MAC and MSP Airport. We have a team based on the, the projected passengers that come from the airlines to our various partners. We kind of know what kind of day that we're going to have. Again, you mentioned today going to be probably the busiest around July 4th. So we knew today was going to be busy. So we have extra staff with uh, folks with signs and, and banners to guide people to the right line, whether that's the uh, TSA line or the general check-in line. So we want to give that guidance. And then we also have team members saying, hey, if you're in a different concourse, you would be better off to go to the north checkpoint because it's less of a time to get through the checkpoint. So we've been doing that all morning and we do that every day, but we're really cognizant when we have busy days like today. Mm. Now, there's some cancellations out on the East Coast. Are travelers here seeing any impact here on their travel plans? It's possible. I mean, I think in the last week there's been so much demand in air travel and we've had sort of the ripple effect from whether it's uh, staffing with the air traffic controllers that has reduced the number of flights that can come into some airports, especially on the East Coast, weather can have a ripple effect. So certainly that can have a play here with flights. Uh, so far today, I don't think we have a lot of cancellations and delays. But for folks that are starting their journey here at MSP, they may be going to one or two other airports connecting. That might come into play. And so we always advise just to stay connected to your airlines. Today may be a great day. And on the return trip, it might be weather, it might be staffing that might uh, cause a, a ripple through those plans. Yeah, you mentioned having a great day. Looking at the uh, MSP airport website right now, only one cancellation, no delays, and everything else is on time. So Jeff Lee, the manager of strategic communications for the airport. Hey, thanks for joining us this morning and have a great day. You bet. Thanks.